this is Mario Stolz. Today I'll show you how you can upload your CAD model into the cloud and then view it from any mobile device as augmented reality model. So first thing we need to do is open a CAD model. So I'll go into Crew Parametric, browse through my PDM system and find the model. So I can look at the different options. That is the model that I want to open and I will open that into Crew Parametric. So now that I've got the model open, you'll see it's a 3D model. I can go to my tools menu and click on the target. So I'll use a spatial target for this model. The next step is to position the spatial target. So how far do you want the motorbike to be from the ground? So I want to see it on the ground so I can simply drag it or I can double click on the value and enter the offset value that I want to use. Accept that to complete the position of the spatial target and the next step is then to publish this model. So if I select the publish model, accept the license agreement and that will then upload the model. So that's the name of the model that it will show. You can specify the quality of the model that you want to see and select the target as a reference and click on OK. So if you do have a PDC account, it will ask you for your login details. You can enter that and it will create a lightweight viewable version of this file that will then be uploaded to the cloud. Okay, once this is done, I can close the window and then go to the manage model options. This will then show me my models that I've got available that I can share. So you can share up to five models at a time with a standard license. If I click on the share button, it will give me the option to send it to someone by email. So I'll email this to myself and I can add a message and send the email. Or what I could also do is use my phone and let's say you've gone and downloaded the application. So let me share my screen. Okay, so I've shared my screen. If you go to the Creo View icon, it's this one at the top and open that up. You can then point to a vice and flat position it or I could go to the actual email that it will send me and open that up or if I go back to my camera on my phone once you've installed the app and I'm just going to minimize this so that I can point to the actual code, the QR code. I will pick up the QR code and select the option. So what that will then do on my phone we go back to my phone it picks up the app i need to point to a flat surface so i'll point to a surface on my desk click on the screen that will then go and load the model and once loaded i can scale it up or down i can position this and this is now an augmented reality version of this model so i can move it around i can rotate it so if i want to see this on the inside I can move my, I'm using my phone so I can move it closer, I can move it into the model, I can look at it from different angles. So it's quite a good design tool that you can use inside the design office if you want to see what something is going to look like in real life, even at a one-to-one -one scale on the model. So it's a really simple and easy tool to use. So if I just go back to Creo, so if I specify that and I use the send mail option, that will then send an email. Okay, so if I go back to my mobile device and go to the email, you'll see that it has now sent me an email with all the information. So there is the option that you can go to the App Store, download, or go if you click directly on the Launch AR option, it will then also load the model. Thanks for watching, and please feel free to contact us if you need more information.